So are you the type of person that goes out and buys the nicest cuts of meat, the biggest turkey for Thanksgiving or Christmas, or maybe some wild Atlantic salmon that just has to be cooked perfect? Then this video is for you. So are you one of the people that test their meat with their fingers? Where this is rare, this is medium rare, this is sort of well done and this is a throwaway job. But what if, what if you've got arthritis and you can't bend your fingers? Or what if you've got a lot of calluses and this part actually feels really tough all the time? Then it won't work. Or are you one of these people? Someone that gets the poker out and just keeps Ow! stabbing the meat every 10 minutes to see if those juices run clear, testing for doneness that way? Or are you the type of person that carries a stopwatch? You weigh, you love maths. You weigh every piece of meat. You check the temperature all the time. You program it in per pound, per kilogram. You hope that your oven or your smoker doesn't lose one degree Celsius or one degree Fahrenheit for those few hours. And you wait for this little thing to go off to let you know that it's perfect. Well, fear not guys, because I've got two thermometers that'll make you a better cook than you already are. This is the Thermapro TP27 wireless thermometer. That's got four probes, and you can either choose to use them in one piece of meat, so your meat looks like this, or you can put it in different meats that require different temperatures and different times of cooking. This Thermapro TP27 has a wireless range of up to 500 feet. So that means you can leave this at the site where you're cooking. You can either stick it on the barbecue using the magnet feature on the back. You can stand it on your barbecue using the stand on the back. Or you can hang it next to your barbecue using this cool hang feature. So you don't need to carry the big transmitter around everywhere. That will obviously stay at your barbecue oven or smoker. And all you need to carry around is this little thing, which is nice and light. It's got a stand. It's also got a magnet, the same as the transmitter. You can put it in your pocket or you can clip it on your belt. The Thermapro comes with four 6.2 inch stainless steel probes that have an accuracy of plus or minus 1.8 degrees Fahrenheit. The cable that comes with each of these thermometers is 43 inches, so it allows you to place the transmitter in a location that's close enough to the barbecue, yet far enough away from being burned. Unless you're like me, of course, I've had a few fat fires where I would have burned that, would have burned that transmitter right up. Now, if any of you have seen my last review, if not, I'll chuck a link up in here. This is the Thermapro TP20. Now, one thing that it did have, if you look at the display, which is different to the TP27, it allowed morons like myself to cook a lot better because I didn't have to look up this cooking chart to know what temperatures that I wanted my meat to look at. I just pressed a button. I'd go through the meat from fish to ham to pork, program, chicken, whatever you wanted to do, you could just push a button. It was nice and simple. So Thermapro, when you're next to a four probe thermometer, can you please include this for us dummies? This is the Smartro ST54. It's a dual probe thermometer and it's not wireless, which means that you have to stay at the site where you're cooking. Like the Thermapro, it's also got a magnet on the back, as well as a clip, as well as a stand. So we can do all the same features as what the Thermapro can. It just can't transmit up to 500 feet. What I love most about the thermometer with the Smartro is it's bent. It's also got a spring-loaded section here to protect the actual cable. So it doesn't matter if your hands are oily, you can always get a good grip so that you can jam in that thermometer in any type of meat, in any type of conditions. You can also pull it out quick when it gets hot, because believe me, the ends of these thermometers, after sitting in the oven, they get really hot. The one thing I love about the Smartro ST54 is all the presets for temperatures that's already programmed in it. So as you'll notice here, once you press the meat button, it'll go from well done to medium to rare. It'll also go to hamburgers, chicken, you can check anything you want and you can also program your own temperature in this space as well. So Smartro, what we need is a memory function that keeps that temperature in there all the time. So if that's the only one you ever wanna use, 
well it's perfect so guys it all comes down to this should you buy the Thermo Pro or should you buy the Smartro well let your budget decide and let your functionality also decide they are two totally different thermometers one's wireless allows you the freedom of walking around having a beer in one hand checking your meter a couple of hundred feet away maybe maybe in the neighbor's place maybe you're over there getting a sausage off their barbecue or maybe you're drinking their beer and you can watch your food back here and not get in trouble from your wife or maybe maybe you just want something that looks classy sits right next to the oven so when people come in and it still confidence confidence in them that you can cook if that's the case then you want to buy the Smartro but just know no matter which one you buy both of them will work perfectly both of them will make your food come out the best so check the links in the descriptions guys and make sure you buy one for your partner for Christmas